Welcome to Quantao. In this video, we will cover updated features to place limit, stop, stop limit and market order from the charts. To place orders from the charts, enable mouse trading at the top right corner. To select the quantity, you can either use the predefined quantity buttons or type the custom quantity. Then select the product type you want to trade. Now move the cursor on the chart and as you move the cursor below the current price, you will notice two options, buy limit and sell stop. Left click is to place buy limit order and right click is to place sell stop order. If you move the cursor above the current price, you will notice two options, buy stop and sell limit. Left click is to place buy stop order and right click is to place sell limit order. Now let me place some orders on the chart. I will select the quantity each time I want to place an order and move the cursor on the chart to place the orders. As you can see, now I have placed buy limit, buy stop, sell limit and sell stop order. These orders are visible on the charts as well as on the working order panel below. To modify any orders from the chart, simply drag the cursor and order gets modified. To cancel a single order, click on the pending order line and click cancel button and order will be cancelled. There are few quick buttons on the order dashboard at the right side of the chart to perform quick order management tasks. Based on the type of orders placed as well as the open positions, the dashboard will automatically highlight the available actions. Buttons such as reverse will close the existing open positions and create a position in the opposite direction with original quantity for the symbol. Close positions button will close the open positions for the symbol. Flatten button will close the existing open positions as well as cancel all pending orders for the symbol. In Quantower, stop limit orders can be placed very easily. Select the checkbox, use SL limit. By default, the tick offset is 1, which is equal to 0 0.05 for NSC cash and FNO symbols. That means stop limit order will be placed one tick or 0 0.05 away from the trigger price. You can type the custom offset simply by typing the required offset value. For example, 10 tick offset will place stop limit order 0 0.50 away from the trigger price. In the FNO symbols, SL limit is predefined since stop market orders are not allowed. To place buy stop limit order, place the cursor above the current price and click at the price you want to trigger a stop order. In this example, I will place a buy stop order at 328.70 as trigger price with 10 tick offset. The working order panel displays trigger price as 328.70 and stop limit order with 10 tick offset that is 0 0.50 above the trigger price which is at 329.20. Even when I modify this order from the chart, it will remember the tick offset and just adjust the limit price accordingly. As you can see, I simply drag the trigger price to 329.30 
and the stop limit was placed at 10 ticks higher at 329.80. So it's very easy to place all types of orders from the charts. In the next video, we will discuss about how to place market orders from the charts. For more videos and updates, subscribe to our YouTube channel and join us on Telegram and Twitter. Thank you for watching.